Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for July 20th of 2024 is titled Apollo 11 Landing Panorama. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image of the moon and in fact a panoramic view as adjusted from images taken by the Apollo 11 crew. And in fact, this was taken by Neil Armstrong only an hour or so after the first landing on the moon. Now that's after they landed, as we can see, they're on the surface here, but they have not yet exited the lunar module. So they were still inside, in fact, documenting and taking pictures of the entire landing site, just in case something happened and they had to leave before they were able to actually explore the surface. So the idea was to document everything and have as much information as they could to be able to return to Earth. Now, as we look off here, we see and that, that there is a crater in the foreground. That crater, just for a sense of scale, is about 12 meters in size. So I'll give you an idea of what the scales are like here. There are a lot of smaller craters around as well. And we see that some of these craters are very old and worn, including that larger one, meaning that it's been around for a long time and has had time to settle and for other craters to occur around it and kind of start to fill it in. And that will happen over time uh, on Earth as well as on the moon. On Earth, it happens relatively fast and craters don't last a very long time. On the moon, it happens much more slowly so that craters can be billions of years old. Now, this is not a single image from Apollo 11. This is actually put together from the scans of the original images that were taken. So in fact, if you look to the far left hand side here, that was the very first image ever taken by a person on another world on some place other than Earth. So first picture taken from the surface of another object. And then other objects here and then assembling them digitally together to be able to get a panoramic view of what the Apollo 11 landing site would have looked like to Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin when they landed there. And in fact, that would have been 55 years ago today with the landing having been July the 20th of 1969. And of course, after these images were taken and everything was documented, that is when they would make the first steps on the surface of the moon and begin the exploration of our nearest astronomical object to us in space. And that would be our own moon. Now there are plans to return astronauts to the moon again for the first time since 1972, which was the last of the Apollo missions. And work is being done to actually tr take unmanned craft to the moon and then to be able to fly humans around the moon again with the plan for landing there, perhaps by the end of this decade. So that was our picture of the day for July 20th of 2024. It was titled Apollo 11 Landing Panorama. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Hoodoo. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.